Okay, Taurus. Hi, Taurus. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, thank you guys for your support, your subscriptions, your shares, your likes, your comments, your donations. It does not go unnoticed. If you have Taurus anywhere in your chart, this reading may resonate for you. Or if your person does, this may resonate for you also. All right. So let's tap into your guys' energy. The first thing that I heard was energy harvesting. So someone here could be trying to harvest your energy or harvest your person's energy or someone here is in the energy of harvesting people's essence is what I heard, Taurus. Oh, happy birthday to you guys that we're in Taurus season right now, all right? Commitments are very important around this time. So be careful to like not be scattered all over the place. It's all about commitments. It's all about family. It's all about staying true to not religion, but the rules of the land and things of that such. A lot of you guys could be like moving or relocating for us. Okay, so we have feather. Think first before you judge. All right. So that card usually comes out when there's a gang of people judging one person. Uh, don't doubt your worth. Lighthouse energy. So maybe you guys were... And the energy of being um, judged by somebody or something. I'm hearing a machine. Oh, okay. Um, something about... It could have been like an organization going against you guys, Taurus. Alright? Because I'm hearing a machine. Like, you know how they say like uh, certain corporations are a machine or... Yeah, like something here is a machine... I'm hearing something about a record label is a machine. It's like it's it's operated by the devil or something like that. It could be like a uh, a job that's like the the energy was just dark all around it, or someone here's trying to get out of a a machine. I don't know why I'm getting that energy. It's like it's it seems evil though. We have receiving and we have grief. Tears are what happens when the ice in the heart melts receiving every day it becomes easier to receive the highest divine plan and trust my inner guidance i feel like this is two different energies one person is in the energy of grief the other person is the energy of receiving faith here miraculously amazingly everything i need always comes love is opening me to receive beyond anything that i imagine then we have self-love out here okay um detachment and inner power yeah what is there a group of people going through something right now a group of people going through grief i was just tapping into this um and the collective reading. Let's see what else is out here. Someone here try to get you to doubt your worth because you are different. What else please for Taurus, Holy Spirit, Angels? Hmm. What else please for Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels? Okay, so we have release control, first quarter moon in Taurus. So I feel like we're on track. Release control and release your blocks. First quarter moon in Scorpio. Isn't Taurus and Scorpio opposite of each other? So if you have a north node in Taurus, your south node will be in Scorpio. Release your blocks and release control. Because Scorpio does have the energy of blocking people. Taurus is the energy of controlling people sometimes. Some of you are trying to control you guys. Okay, and then we have breathe through the tension. Yeah, someone here is mad that they can't control some someone or something or that someone here released their blocks in the situation. Yep, I'm getting that. All right. So it's like, yeah, definitely I'm getting like south node, north node energy. Someone here has a north node in Taurus. Someone here wanted you to be in your south node. The energy of Scorpio. Those are two very opposite signs because one is very like. Um, Scorpio is very obsessive in a way, in a south node sense. And Taurus is like more. They're, com they're stubborn in a north node sense. So someone here can't change someone's mind. Oh, okay. There's someone here obsessed with trying to change someone's mind. It's not going to happen. What else, please, for Taurus? Give me the energy, please, for Taurus. Sun, moon, rising, and north node, Venus. 
Peace energy, please, for Taurus right now. Lack of, yeah, lack of respect. Harassment is here. Someone is like, is trying to harass someone or something. Trying to get them to change their mind. We also have accountability out here. Harassment, lack of respect. Disrespectful energy. Entitled energy, yeah. This is what I'm getting here, Taurus, so far. Let's keep going. Um, my heart isn't with the karmic. Um, I'm attracted to anyone with money. Yep. Taurus, the Hierophant, Father, Morals, and Religion. And then we have Pisces out here. The High Priestess, Intuition, and Illusions. Oh, okay. What was that last Taurus reading I did? Oh. Okay. What's underneath this Pisces energy? Greener grass. Yep, okay. Someone was putting someone in an illusion, making them think that the greener, the grass was greener on their side. It was not. Their heart is not with that karmic. That's what, yes. Thank you, spirit. They have to, they're facing accountability that their heart is not with the karmic. It's with you. This person is entitled to their energy. I feel like there's a masculine here who's like a father. Or they may take care of a lot of people. And someone's like, oh, I want some of that. So it's like this Pisces or this shapeshifter. I'm getting shapeshifter energy. Someone here that likes to walk around in the spiritual realm when they're not supposed to be in the spiritual realm. This Pisces energy. They could be a high priestess, but they like to cause illusions here. Someone here was like, this is funny. I keep pausing because I'm getting downloads. Someone here was like, um, attracted to your person. Got this person to like count you out. Now they regret it. They're realizing that this person is disrespectful and they only want them for money. And they're really entitled. Some of you are just like, they're, they're an energy harvester. Their heart is not with this person. So they're facing accountability. They're like, okay, I dealt with someone that was a little bit off, you know, had a few screw loose, screw looses because they saw me as a father energy. They saw me as a leader, as a hierophant, or this could be your energy here. But I'm really getting like, this was someone who follows morals they follow the rules here someone was like oh my god follow the rules with me right Taurus so then they were like you know what I'd rather go back to my divine feminine because it seems like you're only attracted to anyone with money it's like they they saw that this father energy had money so they're like they did the most to try to get this person to judge you or they they're just really disrespectful clarify accountability please for Taurus Accountability, please, for Taurus. I couldn't tell you face to face. I fear that you will reject me. I fantasize about you. And then we have I lied to you. Wow. It's really hard for this person to face accountability. Yeah, if you're dealing with a Taurus, if this is a cross watcher dealing with a Taurus, that's very understandable. Um, they're very stubborn. They may be more moralistic and about, you know, the rules and everything, but they're stubborn whenever they do something wrong. They don't really face accountability the way that they should. Yeah, you are not part of my plan. They're telling a karma that they're not part of their plan. This disrespectful energy, they're like, you know, you're not even, you're just for fun or, I don't know, I thought you were something that you're not. So this third party try to get this father energy to commit to them, but maybe they already had children or they already had a marriage here. But this person was very disrespectful too. So I don't know, this person may want to fight you or something. They come off that way. Clarify harassment or lack of respect, please, for Taurus. Um, your body language says so much. I've been struggling. Hmm. Yeah. So this person knows that this third party here has been struggling financially and they know for a fact that this person just wants to use them for money. They know for a fact what's going on here with this person. They know that they're entitled. They could be just be like a spoiled little brat type energy. This could literally be like a side chick type that's just entitled to everyone else's man. That's really what I'm getting here. It's like whenever they see someone in a relationship, they want that. Instead of go finding their own, they try to make someone else their man. It's like this person tries to make, if this person had, has been faithful to you, they try to make this person be faithful to them. And that's crazy. They thought that they were going to get the same treatment as you. Clarified entitled energy for Taurus. Yeah, I never want to feel that way again. I know you're watching me. I was careless with you. 
clarify that again. I never want to feel that way again with the entitled energy. I lied to you. Hmm. This person was lied to by this third party, by this entitled energy. They never want to do that again. They never want to put you through that again. It was merely an experience. I know you're watching me is here. So this third party is watching this person, making sure they don't come towards you. That is, oh my God. You might not even know this person. Oh, you do. I know more than you think. Sometimes I hear your voice. Yeah. You know what's going on here. You might not know exactly what's going on. But yeah, this person is like making sure some of your lied to you guys to protect you. But really, it's because there's a disrespectful, entitled energy behind them. To clarify, my heart isn't with the karmic. My heart isn't with the karmic. I forgive you here. To clarify, my heart isn't with the karmic. I forgive you for Taurus. To clarify, my heart. To clarify, my heart isn't with the karmic. I forgive you. We are more alike than I admit. Yeah, they're like, you know what? I Being with this person, it may have been disrespectful for them to even be with this person or to be with these people that judged you. But it's like it's showing them themselves and it's showing them you. So they're like, you know what? We're actually more alike. I'm not in the energy of needing, wanting to be used. So this person may be um, attracted to someone that used them. And they're like, now I see what you mean, Taurus. They, It's like you don't. I don't trust you and I hope you're happy. Yeah, it's like you didn't trust them because you felt like you just didn't want to be used. And now they're like, okay, yeah, I know what you mean because I also attracted someone that wanted to use me too. So actually we're more alike than I admit. So this person attracted somebody that attracted somebody that tried to use them. Clarify, I'm attracted to anyone with money for Taurus. You didn't imagine it. You told this person. You already knew what the heck was going on here. I wondered how far this would go. This person is also very like, um, they don't know how to change up. They don't know how to switch up. They don't know how to like save themselves from not being caught by do from doing something here. They're like, yeah, yeah, I like people for money. Yeah, I like to be taken care of by other people's men. It's like they have no shame in their game. They're like, yeah, you didn't imagine that. Yeah, I stole money from you. Or yeah, during that date, I did, I don't know, I did only want to see what you can buy for me. They wondered how far I would go. I'm different now and you're so easy to see through here. Yeah, so it's like they, they're telling the karmic that they're so easy to see through and it's helping them change. They're also said I need to focus on my healing. Yeah. Clarify this Taurus energy, please. Yeah, they're like, I know what I saw. I know I know who this person is. Clarify this Taurus energy, please. This person's like, either the third party is really naive, really young, or they feel like that's the way to live their life. I was careless with you. They're realizing they were careless with you, and they try to see what another party was about. They thought the grass was greener somewhere else is what I'm getting here. Nah, it was not greener. They were literally going to run into the energy of being used. Sometimes I hear your voice. So it's like you're you telling them I told you so. You told this person that they were going to get used or that this person was no good. Or that they were just going to only use them. Should I use this deck? Yeah, I'll use this deck. Okay. All right. So we have uh, the star card out here with the ace of pentacles. Someone here definitely wants to heal something with you. I feel like you get a new start. I'm getting star seed energy. Justice in the reverse. Someone here did something to you that was not fair. So I'm guessing in the midst of you getting blessed, this person was doing unfair things to you. Okay. They would probably, they're not going to tell you everything about this, but they're going through a lot of like karma right now. They're not going to tell you everything, which is why I'm guessing you guys are in tarot or coming to tarot for this, but they're not going to tell you everything that happened with this person. Or everything that was said. I feel like it had a lot to do with gaining up on you. That's why. So energy please for Taurus. And 
energy please for Taurus, Holy Spirit, Angels? What's the energy please for Taurus right now, Holy Spirit, Angels? Ace of Wands in reverse, a failed mission. Mission aborted. Five of Swords in the reverse, yeah. What else please for Taurus? Someone here definitely feels defeated. It was unwise to do something here, to go after something. Someone here was like maybe sexually driven by something or someone. Yeah, the Knight of Wands in reverse. They were sexually driven to go towards an Empress in the reverse. What is wrong with them? Or this Empress in the reverse doesn't love themselves. We have the Chariot out here with the Fool in the reverse. Yeah, they're moving away from this person. Yeah, they're trying to manifest. They're trying to work on being coming, becoming a better masculine or something like that. But yeah, they were dealing with an empress in the reverse. And I feel like that's exactly what triggered it. They're like, oh, okay, now I get it. I don't want to be around somebody that's an empress in the reverse. I don't care how pretty they are. I don't care how, how good it looks on the outside. I don't want to be around someone that feels entitled to my energy. What else, please, for Taurus? This person can't manifest in their life, this third party, this empress in the reverse. They don't even love themselves enough. Yeah, the knight of cups in the reverse, love bombing energy, very jealous, very malicious. Could be a fake friend of yours also. Five of swords in reverse and the ten of swords in reverse. Something here did not touch you, it did not bother you. This person tried to get a reaction out of you, tried to get underneath your skin, it did not work. Yeah, because you already knew better. You are not waiting for this person to come back either. You weren't even waiting for the person to come back. What else, please, for the collective? They feel like you will reject them, too. They feel like if they did tell you everything, that you will reject them. What else, please, for Taurus? Yeah, the Six of Swords in the verse, they can't move on. They can't move forward. Queen of Pentacles in the, Queen of Cups in the verse. I feel like this reading is picking up the energy of that entitled third party. Very codependent energy that cannot move forward. Very emotionally unstable. But the scales are being balanced out here, Taurus. So it's like this person just got to deal with it. What else, please, for Taurus right now? Holy Spirit and Angels. Page of Swords. Yep, they're watching and spying. Angry as heck. Angry. So imbalanced. No healing. This person needs help. Hangman, they're stuck and stagnant. What did this person expect? Everything is fine is here. It's like they try to put knives in your back, but everything is still fine with you. They're wondering how you're doing that. Five of Cups in the verse of Three of Wands. It's like you got your back turned waiting for something else to happen while this person is in the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. This person needs some money. Their their magician is their magician work is not working. They overdid something here. Someone here is like someone here notices it too. It's like they can't even hide the fact that they're some sort of crazy evil magician lady it's like like i feel like this person thinks that they're higher than they're not yeah i'm also getting like this person may try to mess up a connection between you and your person by like saying yeah well they were over here with me just the other day blase blase blah you know saying things like that but the truth of the matter is this person is mad because they were entitled to your person's energy and they thought that they were going to get something that you got, but they're not even the Empress upright. <laughs> they're in the reverse. Look, the Four of Wands and the Four of Pentacles. I feel like your guys' uh, relationship is protected. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're in the energy of receiving. They're in the energy of grief. And they're watching this. Clarify the Ace of Wands in the reverse, please, for Taurus. Something here failed. They thought they were going to take your person for all their money. Ace of Wands in reverse. They thought that your person was stupid. Ace of Wands in reverse, please, for a Taurus. The Fool card. Yeah, they jumped into something. They thought something here was going to work. They had a lot of faith in it, too. Magician in the reverse. Yeah. Four of Wands in reverse. They thought that they could, like, be a homewrecker. Clarify the Fool for Taurus. Clarify the Fool for Taurus. I'm going to label this angry homewrecker something, something, something. Clarify the fool, please, for Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels. Ace of Pentacles, Two of Cups in the Reverse. 
Yeah, they're breaking up with this person. Nine of Wands is here. They're blocking them. They're setting up boundaries. It's like they're protecting you almost. They're protecting their their blessing, their gift. You're protecting your gift too. All right. Clarify the Knight of Wands in the reverse, please, for Taurus. Really reckless energy out here. They thought that they can control this person with sexual energy. Clarify the Knight of Wands in the reverse, please, for Taurus. Why is this reading funny to me? It's like, it's real funny. This person really thought they were going to get something out of this. We have the Six of Cups out here with the Four of Wands in reverse and the Magician in reverse. Three of Wands in reverse. They thought they could home wreck. They thought they could mess up a, a stable foundation with children in it too. You might have children with this um, energy. They thought that they were... Tower. They're not strong enough. I'm also getting like they wouldn't even be a good mother. Empress is in the reverse. They would never be able to even fill your shoes. So this person could never even try to take your place. Clarify. Oh my God. Clarify Empress in the reverse, please, for Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels. They wonder why they're being ignored. They were into magic, too. Clarify uh, the Empress in the reverse for Taurus. Knight of Cups. Eight of Swords in the reverse of the Ten of Swords. Two of Wands in the reverse. So this person likes to sweet talk people. Why the Eight of Swords in the reverse? Six of Swords in the reverse of the King of Pentacles. <sighs> yeah, it's not working. The sweet talking is not working. The words aren't working. The curses aren't working. Some of you are still moving forward away from, they're recovering from their addictions or something like that. Or they're still moving forward away from this Cancer or this Capricorn, this devil energy. They're like, where are you going? This is unfinished. Clarify the Knight of Cups in reverse. A very jealous and malicious energy. Who are they jealous of? I'm guessing it's you, but I feel like this person is like, ending that they feel betrayed that someone here is moving away from them or that they got free from their magic they really thought this magic was going to work on your person your person could be like older than this person or they just been through a lot or something like that yeah look seven of swords a liar a deceiver a sabotager but not putting in the work try to mess with your work to get something from your person six of pentacles with the star ace of wands in reverse they really thought i'm also getting like they tried to pretend to be authentic they're not authentic. This person is a whole lie. Whoever this third party is or whoever this homewrecker energy is, clarify the seven of swords, please, for Taurus. Yeah, the lovers. <laughs> Empress in the reverse. They tried to be somebody that they weren't in order to get into a connection. I'm, I'm hearing energy harvesting again. They tried to energy harvest an empress, but I feel like it backfired on them or it like, it, it didn't alchemize the way it was supposed to alchemize. Look, the devil and the high priestess in reverse. They're, they're not a high priestess. They have no intuition. In fact, they're evil. This person uses their gifts for evil. Even if they have gifts, it's all bad energy. They don't even know how to use them correctly. But they did all of this to ruin a lover situation or to make someone choose them. They have. I'm hearing they, they were chosen for a minute, but it's like... Someone is overdoing their manipulation or it's obvious that they're a homewrecker. It's like they're making it obvious that that was their intention to break up a happy home or whatever the heck. And it's like really making this person look very unattractive to this to your person. It's like obvious as heck. It's so obvious that this person here was like a homewrecker trying to manipulate your energy. All right. Clarify the Six of Swords in the reverse for Taurus. Six of Swords in the reverse, please, for Taurus. They cannot move on anymore. Six of Swords in the reverse, please, for Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels. High Priestess, the Sun, and the Ten of Cups in the reverse with the Page of Swords. They're watching someone else be happy. They're not happy at all. And I feel like they're still walking around in the spiritual community, maybe watching tarot to keep an eye on you, to make sure that you're not happy. 
This could also be like a dysfunctional family or someone that tried to keep a dysfunctional family together. Yeah. King of Swords is out here, Three of Swords in the reverse. Um, someone here is like being really cold to this person too and healing their heart. Someone here is super unhappy because they've been revealed. Some sort of secret has been revealed about this high priestess out here. Clarify the Queen of Cups in the reverse. For a Taurus. Queen of Cups in the reverse, please, for a Taurus. Seven of Wands in the reverse. Five of Cups out here and the Four of Pentacles in the reverse. Nine of Swords. They cannot believe they got let go. This person has a lot of healing to do. Also, I'm getting like they had no protection on doing whatever they thought that they were going to do. I feel like this person fell flat on their face. Also, I'm getting like your person, this person is also angry because I feel like your person made a promise to them. That promise is not being followed through. Ten of Wands is in reverse with the, yeah, this person is not committing to them. They thought. <laughs> See, that's why you got to be careful with being the other woman. Especially in this energy. Temperance in the reverse. Why is temperance in the reverse here? Please for Taurus, Holy Spirit, Angels. Three of Swords. Ace of Cups. Yep. They're mad because someone here, they feel betrayed that someone here is in love with you. They didn't expect that to happen here. Yeah, they're jealous. They're jealous that they don't even, they're not even noticed. They're not even noticed. And they're just like being detached from clarify the three of swords for taurus holy spirit and angels they feel hurt by this but it is what it is the emperor in the reverse they try to overdo their manipulation or overdo their control or they feel like this person here is like a bad person now because they left them for their family clarify the emperor in the reverse please for taurus they're like you're not an emperor you're an emperor in the reverse because you didn't give me your money page of pentacles in the reverse they're like no i'm i feel like this person also your person also like knew that this person was very naive and they used them in a way but i feel like it was all mental it's like they used them because they tried to use them first type of energy so it's like it i mean both of them aren't really all that great both of them are, are bad energies but at the same time it's like that's what this person gets for thinking that they were going to ruin a home Someone here feels used, Taurus. Clarify the page of swords. So now they're watching, spying on social media. At a distance, though, not saying anything because they know that they were wrong, too. Clarify the page of swords. For Taurus, Holy Spirit, and angels. Page of swords, please, for Taurus. Page of swords. Nine of Swords in the reverse. Something here is not bothering you. Knight of Pentacles is out here with the Ten of Wands. Yep. Someone here is watching someone commit to you. And you're not stressed about nothing. They did all that work for no reason. Yeah, they're bitter. They didn't expect that to happen. And they're crazy as heck, too. It's like they want to kill somebody. You got the Ten. Yeah, look. Now they're like, oh, my foundation is falling down. Yeah, well, you should have thought about that. You should have thought about that. But I'm also getting Taurus that your person here can't accept accountability about what really happened in this story. I feel like it's like they, I don't know, it's, I don't know. This per, I don't know if, if you want to accept this person back, you can. Because you're in the energy of receiving. They're in the, in the energy of releasing all their blocks and getting ready to come towards you. Someone else is so selfish and they're bitter and they're crazy. And they do not want this person to be in the Knight of Pentacles. They're moving slowly but surely towards you and it's just like they shouldn't have been entitled or, or they shouldn't have made it obvious that they were using somebody for money because what do they think someone is stupid? Moon cycles and containment. They were keeping this a secret. Yeah. Alright, let's see. What's going on for Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels? Someone here really thought that they could wreck a home. 
what's going on with Taurus right now. Taurus, Holy Spirit, and Angels. We have Secret, Book of Shadows. There's a bunch of secrets here. Mm -hmm. Someone here released the Book of Shadows on somebody. Low vibrational magic is what I'm getting to get this person on their team, on their side. It didn't work for too long. We have Fertility here. So maybe try to did, did magic on your fertility or did magic on your relationship or your abundance. Your manifestations, whatever you have growing right now. They try to do magic on that. What's going on with Taurus? Also, I'm getting like they try to keep this person occupied to protect you. We have intentions. Wand energy with autumn. Watchtower of the East. This could have happened around autumn time. It should it could have started around autumn time. All right. Someone wants someone to see you as crazy, but really they're coming off as someone crazy because they're the ones that are entitled to someone else's money instead of getting their own life together. This person is losing money and they're mad about it. <laughs> okay, so we have clock time. Time, pressure, and a rush. Someone is trying to be in a rush now, trying to get their stuff together. Investigate, look closely, ask questions, think before asking. They should have thought, they should have thought before this, before they did this. What else, please, for a Taurus? This is what this person gets. We have lead the way. Be a leader. Show others how it's done. You can help others. Yeah, they should have been learning from you instead of trying to take your person. You are showing this person how to be in a relationship. You didn't mean, here, have my relationship. Um, shine bright like a candle. You will make it through this. The right way. Learning to create what you desire. Yeah, um, this is for the this is for the third party. So it looks like they're watching me because it looks like spirit is trying to tell them like stop crying, stop being a big baby. You will get through this. You should have been paying attention. You should have known better, right? This karmic energy is like so distraught and codependent. It's like they need advice, but instead of getting it from you, it's like they want to get it from you, but they hate you. They want to tell you something. They hope that whatever they tell you puts you in some sort of stress, but it's not. It's not going to put you any any sort of stress, really. It's just going to make you move forward. This person is just doing this because they're mad. If this would have worked, they would have kept it a secret. But now, because things aren't working in their life, they're going to come out and tell you this secret, this big old secret, right? All right, Taurus, this is your reading. Hope this resonated for you. If it did... Go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. See you next time. Bye.